a big role in that process in Virginia. News 3 reporter Anthony Sabella live this morning in Virginia Beach with um, how that's going to play out and what this means for your privacy. Yeah, Blaine, well, according to the State Department of Health, a lot of the tech that we're talking about here is what's going to be on your phone. It's a proximity smartphone app tracking people infected with COVID-19 to try and figure out who they might have come into contact with. Now, health, health experts say this contact tracing is what it's called is key in stopping the spread of the virus. VDH is still working out specifics, including which app they'll use, but the department says it'll be available on Android and Apple. It's to help protect people, department leaders say, and they know privacy is going to be a pretty big concern for the app's users. Any app that we choose will have the ability for the person to opt in or opt out and not be tracked as they wish. We plan to be very transparent because we are trying to help people and not make them fearful of any kind of new technology. Now, this app won't be available for a few weeks, we're told. In the meantime, Virginia Department of Health is hiring about 1,300 new workers to help call people who've gotten close to someone infected, telling them to quarantine. And if a person refuses to quarantine, the Department, of, uh, the department says state law allows commissioners to issue a quarantine mandate. We're live in Virginia Beach. Anthony Sabella, News 3.